Hello, my name is Nicole Rasmussen and I'm an area agronomist with DuPont Pioneer in southern Alberta. Today we're in a cornfield and we're going to show you some symptoms of planting into soil that's too wet. We're going to see some spots where the furrows didn't close behind the closing wheels and some sidewall compaction. As you can see, this is in the ground two inches deep, the target depth that grower was trying to achieve. And if we look closer, we can see it's the seed furrow has completely not closed in places. So here's our corn plant that's emerged and you can see that the roots that have come out are traveling vertically down the furrow. The sidewalls here are smooth and very hard packed. So unless moisture conditions improve and the soil is somehow able to soften up, chances are that the root development of this corn seedling would be severely hampered. So the main consequence for the corn crop when the furrow is enclosed and the seed isn't properly covered and packed with soil is going to be slower emergence. Corn needs to absorb a significant amount of moisture to germinate and when it doesn't have proper soil contact emergence is slower. You can envision this corn seed in the bottom of this furrow probably the most making 50 percent contact with the soil around it so it's going to absorb the moisture much slower than its neighbors that are properly packed. So if we come back here in a few weeks, we'll probably see that where the furrow is open, the corn plants will have emerged slower. And when corn plants emerge slower than those around them, they can often turn into runs and unable to reach their full yield potential.